Good day guys. This video is going to be a quick one so that I can show you how to do bank shots. Not too many people are aware that you can do them intentionally and this is going to be a quick run through of exactly how you do that. So I'm going to be using a one of the zone live events because there's a couple of spots in this live event that are perfect for highlighting exactly how to do bank shots. So this next zone is going to be the first one and if you watch the controls on the screen you'll see that a split second after I press and hold shoot, I drag the thumbstick across to the right or in the direction of the basket. And you'll see that both times that forces a bank shot. I'm now going to run the exact same live event without moving the thumbstick so you can get a, a comparison of what the shot looks like if you're uh, just shooting regularly. So these two positions, the one at the top of the key and the one right next to the ring, are, two, uh, are not in ideal spots for bank shots, but these second two are perfect. So no thumbstick moving there, and you can see that it's uh, just a regular shot, and same here. And finally, I'll do it one last time, but once again, uh, doing the bank shots on those final two spots. In my testing, you can actually move the thumbstick in any direction, but it just seems to make more sense if you move it towards the basket. <coughs> so once again, these first two zones uh, are useless for bank shots, but these next two will highlight that if you move that thumbstick to the right a split second after pressing and holding shoot, it forces that bank shot, up, bank shot up, which is particularly cool if you're using someone like Tim Duncan. Just adds a little bit of realism to the game. Thanks for watching guys, if you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe and check back regularly for new content.